half teaspoon of chocolate powder, two ounces of oats, two ounces of granola, and half cup of yogurt. You can use any yogurt that you prefer to use. I'm using also three frozen ripe bananas. Now everything is added to our blender and we're gonna start blending. But I noticed that I had some moringa, like a teaspoon remaining. And so I decided to add it to my blender along with some ice. I used one cup of ice. You can also omit the ice from the recipe. You can just use room temperature water, but the ice also add <laughs> extra enjoyment to this drink because it is rather cool and refreshing. So I'm giving this all a good blend at this point. But before I continue, so we're gonna continue giving this a good blend but before I continue with this recipe I want to remind you of my previous recipe all right so everything is probably well blended but let me just say, if you're a person that like chunks in your smoothies or punch, I do suggest that you use the granola last. After everything is properly well blended, you add the granola and pulse it so you will have pieces and chunks of granola within the drink. Or you can just sprinkle it on the drink once it is completed in the blender. So this is the end result of my chocolate banana oats smoothie slash punch do hope you enjoy watching and to all my new subscribers thank you so much for your support and welcome